Best scene of April Fool. Just do what you have to do. Don't let them get away with it this time. Don't... Jake falls silent. His eyes are open and he's staring at April. God, Jake, no! Please! April looks down and realizes it is over. She closes his eyes and sits silently for a moment. Jumping to her feet, she turns to the men lined up against the wall and aims her gun at the one furthest to the left. He starts to plead with her in German. Fräulein, im Gottes Namen bitte, bedenken Sie doch. In God's name? God has long vanished from your life. Just then, Grant enters with his men, guns drawn. Nobody move! At Grant's voice, April turns and lowers her guns. The German passes out. Nobody is moving, idiot. Especially not Jake. He's dead. What the hell happened here? Bunch of liars. The lot of you. Why couldn't you tell me what was really going on here? Soot bursts in and stops short with surprise when he sees who has the upper hand. At his sudden entry, Grant and April whirl around and the two of them point their guns at him, leaving the Germans against the wall unguarded. One of them goes for a concealed weapon and aims at Grant. St. Clair, look out! Soot dives at Grant, pushing him from the line of fire. The bullet hits Soot, center forehead, killing him. April shoots the German and picks up his gun. Now she holds three weapons. Grant scrambles to his feet. April tosses him the spare gun. I don't bloody believe it. First Jake, then Sooty. And the time it takes me to blame. Again, she drops to her knees, now cradling Soot in her arms. And the time it takes me to blame. This wasn't in the plan, Sooty. We need to frisk the rest of these guys, April. Cover me while I do it. I can't stand it, Grant. It's too much. Both of them dead. Both of them. How does that happen? We're the good guys. It's not supposed to finish like this. I don't think I can- Don't think at all, April. You'll just be wasting everybody's time. Everyone who believed in you and trained you? Are you telling me that Suit died for nothing and Jake? Is that how you want it to finish? Will I write my report that April Tab was a dead loss, that she didn't have what it took, that hiring her was K&R's Jake's biggest mistake? ASIO will, will, read, will read that report. It'll go to Interpol, and you'll look like... You can take your reports and shove them. I'm covering you. Frisk them. Do it. Grant lays the guns at April's feet. Although tears run down her face, April's hands are steady on her guns as Grant checks the Germans. He finds a knife on one and a small revolver on another. Pocketing them, he backs away and takes up his guns. Lena collapses in a corner. Grant pulls her to her feet. She can show me around. I'm going through to the other rooms to make sure there's nothing back there that can jump out at us. Or my guys. They're outside, surrounding this place, waiting for the word. Can you watch this lot without me? April nods. You grab Suit's bag. We'll take it with us when we go. There may be personal effects in there which his family will want. He leaves with Lena. April picks up Suit's bag and opens it. Keeping one gun on the Germans, she looks inside. There's a bloody arsenal in here. She takes a while to sort through the items. She hears Grant returning with Lena and tosses everything back in the bag and moves it out of the way with her foot. There's only one other exit and I've locked it. Nobody can come in or out without me. So what's the plan? My radio's dead down here. I can't reach my guys. I go out front and get them to come back in with, with the cuffs. Then we'll call the police. Can you hold down the fort? I'd send you out, but they don't know you. They could be jumpy with a stranger. Sure, no worries. I'm not staying with her, she's crazy. Take her with you, one less for me to worry about. As soon as Grant and Lena leave, April moves fast. She takes the set of keys that are hanging on the wall next to the door. She finds the key which locks the door back out to the rooms that Grant has just come from inspecting. She locks the door and removes the gas mask and canisters from Sip's bag. She places the canisters in a corner by the front door. Fraulein, what are you doing? Something you should be very familiar with. Fraulein, please. He moves towards her and she shoots him in the foot. He collapses, screaming. Anyone else want to help me? One-handed, using the other to keep her gun trained on the men, April manages to put on the gas mask, opens the valves on the canisters, and extracts the dynamite and timer from Soot's bag. She exits the room swiftly, slamming the door behind her. The Germans start to cough. Extreme close-up of canisters. Below the poison sign are the words, caution. Once activated, valves cannot be shut off. Now we'll repair. Interior, condemned pub, corridor, night. April locks and bolts the door, positions dynamite strategically, and sets timer to go off in six minutes. She begins to run. 
Exterior condemned pub, dawn. April comes into the daylight, charging out of the underground corridor. Grant is just about to enter with his men. She collides with him and he grabs her arms, ripping off her gas mask. Intercut, timer. Only three minutes remain. What's going on? Why have you come out? And what's this? It's over, Grant. What are you talking about? We still have to- Shoot's bag was a supply depot. No personal effects. Guns, knives, dynamite, gas. What have you done, April? Something I've been dreaming about forever. I'm going back in. It's too late. The gas can't be turned off, and I've set the dynamite on a timer. In under three minutes, this whole place will go up. It'll be like it never existed. If you're smart, you'll get in your cars and start driving. Fast. They scramble to obey her. You can't just let those poor bastards suffocate in there. Really? If you do that, you'll just be like them. You'll be one of them. What do you mean, one of them? You'll have turned into something you've been fighting against for most of your life, April. I'll be a taker of innocent lives? Is that what you mean? A killer of fathers and mothers and children? It's still murder, April, whoever's on the receiving end. I can live with that. I said to Jake a long time ago that I was sick of turning the other cheek. And as much as I'd like to tell the world about what went down here last night, I know I can. But I've set things up here so there'll be very little evidence left at all. One of the tricks Sudi taught me. You coming? Exterior aerial shot to dawn. With Grant on the back of the bike, April rides fast down the parallel road. A huge explosion roars out, blossoming over the countryside. Close up, riding the Harley, tears in her eyes, April smiles. <laughs>